Hey everyone, I'm Big LT. This is a food review. Let's fucking do this. Ah, I've been finally found them. Had, here's the thing. Looked at Walmart, looked at Heidi, local grocery store here, and they didn't have them. They had the they had the little meat stick thing, but they didn't have this. It wasn't until I went to Dollar General and they had them. So finally. Woo, you have no idea how long I'm going to wait for this. Also, this will be a uh, food redo uh, in April when I'm at Scotty's Place for uh, WrestleMania, which is also, we're going to be recording more Sparrow then. We technically didn't get to finish everything in Evening Lake. I did tell him I was supposed to finish it off myself, but I'd rather have those guys involved. So, but anyway, here's the, uh, the lovely beef jerky that looks so good. And just so you guys are aware, yeah, there's not many in there. But that's usually the case with jerky, and I wish there was a lot more than that with a package like that, but they get more expensive, so here we go. Mmm. Dander. Very tender. And chewy, too. Not like the, uh... I don't know if it's Jack Links that does them. There's like another, I think there's like another brand of jerky. They're a lot more tougher. These are more tender and chewy. I like them. Definitely can taste the chili part of it, but not so much the cheese. I think um, I think when we did the food redo, I brought that up too, where I said to uh, Groby and Scotty that when I did the meat stick, I didn't taste any of the cheese, but I could taste the chili. And I think they had a bit of an opposite. I think they can taste the cheese, but I, but not so much the chili, but. And just so you guys are aware, this isn't the only food we do that I'll be doing. I got a few more, including two more boxes of Magic Spoon that I have yet to, yet to touch, that I should do. I'll be doing that for a breakfast thing, I think. This one will go up today. This is going up today. The time recording this will be up today. Um, I think it'll probably be around like, well, it depends on how quick this gets uploaded. I want to say six, but I can't be for sure. Tastes good. So good. I'd buy more if they weren't so damn expensive. I think just for a single bag of this, $5.25. Not joking. Actually, I went to Dodge General not only to get not only to get the jerky, even though I didn't know the jerky was there. But I walked in there. I was going to get some ice cream sandwiches and a thing of Reese's. I got the ice cream sandwiches, but not the Reese's. Then they had the four pack, or the one I was looking for. But when I went in there, there was there's one thing I saw first. I'll show that off because that'll be the next thing. That'll probably be tomorrow. Well. You know, I did two, two, two food reviews tomorrow. It's not a problem. But, um, <clears throat> that is if I remember. Um, I saw that. I had to check the ingredients, too, because I wanted to make sure there wasn't anything that was going to make me, like, eat a little bit of it during the review and then just proceed to not eat the rest. Um, and then I got the ice cream sandwiches. And then I walked down a few more aisles and... I was about to buy the meat sticks again, thinking that's the food review I was looking for. And I was like, wait, I know it's not. It's the beef jerky. But I looked above the meat sticks, and that's when I saw these. And I was like, yes, finally. So I grabbed two <laughs> packages. I met, I, technically speaking, I didn't mean to grab one, but I got so excited I grabbed two without, without noticing until I looked at it. I was like, man, hey, we'll bring the other one for a food review. They'll be, they'll be Scotty and Groby's little thing. They, they can have their food review. I can technically have a, have some of them with them too, you know, because it's mine. I, I have the right to eat my own, you know, the stuff I have for food reviews and food reviews and all sorts of stuff. For some, I looked at the rest of the stuff, looked at the Easter stuff they had there. I didn't see anything else after, after I found the jerky. And then I went to the register and they didn't have my Reese's. I mean, they had Reese's, but they had the two pack. They had the ones with two cups in the package. I wanted one with four. And that was the one I was looking for. You can tell I like these. 
You can tell. No, I'll eat the rest. How many are left in here? Not much. <laughs> I'll eat the rest off camera. Just like so I can get this uploaded. Anyway, um, rating. 10. I'm giving it a 10. <laughs> I love it that much. 10 out of 10 for me. I know I didn't get much of the cheese flavor. That's, that's probably a thing that I wish they had a little bit more of a flavor to. But I can overlook it. I can overlook it because Scotty and Groby, when they did the meat stick one, they, they taste the cheese in that, obviously. I think that's what they said. They can taste the cheese in that. I'll take their words to heart that it's going to be the same with this one. Um, if, they, if, if they don't and they do the, we do the food redo, um, I can't really, like re-rate it in any way so i'm just i'm gonna have to stay with my 10 out of 10. so we'll see what they say they might have they might have a different story than what i'm going through but i'm giving this a 10. 10 out of 10 really do enjoy it now i did say the next one will will be uh for my breakfast and i'll show what that is plus the other uh food video i found while i was at our general so let me get the next magic spoon one here quickly so it's not freaking sitting there, but we're gonna do the, uh, the, the Brazilian. Oh, there it's the uh, peanut butter one. We'll do that uh, for breakfast tomorrow if I remember. Only if I remember. And the other thing I found was this. This one will be also be tomorrow if I decide that. Maybe I can do it later today. Who knows. But if I do it later today, obviously I'll be uploading it for tomorrow instead. So, yeah, Fritos Nashville Hot. I, the only reason why I had to check the ingredients on this one is to make sure there wasn't anything that might taste like pickle. That's kind of my reason for uh, not liking some of the Nashville Hot stuff. Throw that in there. Like I said, I could probably do that review later today. It depends. We'll see what happens. But anyway, thank you all so much for this food review. I've been Big LT. I'll see you guys next time. You have a good day. Take care. Bye-bye.